Yes, uh, Mr. Raima. Yes, brother. I know that you are becoming famous yes. as time goes by. Yes. And soon I am sure that you are going to blow people's yes. mind. I'm telling you. But for those people, the few people who really know you, they know how phenomenal you are. Yes. In terms of your artistic, astronomical, Raima. Raima. Tell someone who has no idea who Raima is. Well, the, reason, the, the problem I have, people are saying that I'm the best Raima in the world, which is not true because I'm the only Raima in the universe. When you are the best in something, when you are the, the best at something, that means the other people are doing it. Sure. So when you say I'm the best, you are minimizing me. Okay. But we, because I know I'm the only one who does that, that thing, don't say I'm the best. Just like the sun, yes, in our yes. solar system, nah, nah. you are the only mind under the sun. Under the sun, because you can go to books, you read books, you ask Google, you ask YouTube, you ask any place, you never get anybody can say something explicit. I love you to be loved and inspire. I do deeply love you. Don't need to inquire. Holding and kissing without the entire here, not any possible satire. You are terrible to me and presentable to my sire. Please give me your entire body as my empire. My soul needs you, even if it's for hire. Please tell me what loving me does require. You are only what I do admire. I'm now squirming to admire. I feel depleted like a depleted tire. I'm hopeless like a chased animal in a fire. I'm paralyzed like a purple paper in a fire. My body itches and I'm off a tire. My breath shakes and I do perspire. The feeling in this situation are dire. Nobody in the world has ever written such rhyming rhyme. Do you know that this rhyme... Allow me, allow me to appreciate you. I, I, <laughs> that, is, that is something out of Shakespeare or something. Um, but, but one thing, one thing I know, one mm-hmm. thing I know is that uh, I'm aware mm-hmm. that right now your prowess in rhyming has caught a celebrity's attention. Right? Attention. And as we speak right now, the the word out there is that she really wants to meet you. Me. In fact, she's dying of curiosity. Who is that wow. guy? Who is that guy who writes these words? Because she has never seen any word like that. She has never seen that word in as far as languages or literature is concerned. Last Sunday, um, because when when you caught her attention, she was abroad. Yeah, she was in the United States of America. Yes. But last Sunday, she jetted in, and uh, all the news media, I guess, especially the online family, were able to. Like welcome her and she was there. Uh, has she gotten in touch with you in any way so far? For me, I'm communicating first through media. Alright. So let it do my brother. I can't approach her, I can't reach her. Mm. But through media. So you're saying Vera is as high as your lyrics? I'm telling you. Or your lyrics, lyrics are higher than your lyrics? My lyrics are higher because my lyrics can even I can use my lyrics in other forms apart from love. So my lyrics are very high. So, but the way, the way I saw her mention, when they mentioned me, mm. the way she so came with very few people like, I mean, I something special mm. in my brain. So, have you ever serenaded a lady through your art form the way you have serenaded uh, this lady you are talking about? I, I did, I did, I did. And, and by the way, the lady we are talking about is Vera, Vera Sika, the, the one and only. That is the lady that Mr. Reimer's lyrics were able to serenade, and she was like, "Wow!" Like I don't know. This is you can go and catch up about the news and social media. But today we just want to ask Mr. Reimer, what is your biggest wish? My biggest wish is sitting with that queen because I know many people all over the world who want to sit with her. They have tried, but they have failed. But for me, I have won her heart through my creativity. Through my creativity, yes. She, in, she did not like my figure, she did not like my money, as people say, money, money, money. The beauty. She like beauty for my brain. And it is that thing that I'm going to use when I'm, I'm with you. For me, mm. I don't approach a woman and say, you have a beautiful legs, right. you have good eyes. Mm. I use rhymes of vibes. For example, eyes. Mr. Mm-hmm. look at that camera. Mm-hmm. 
talk to Queen V. I'm telling you, the police is there. You are relaxed and eyes are meted by this eyes that drive many crazy to their weakness. It is as if God was releasing his music of angels while creating them. Your lips are radiant as if the sun rises and sets in your pretty face. That's why many feel like living in kilometers away from you. Your lips, I mean your hips, let me go down there. Hips, hips, lips, and fingertips. Yes. <laughs> your hips come my head when you hold me hard. Here, my hand is hand hesitant to hand you what until he hatches heavenly happiness in our heavy hearts. Love you are leg grip my life when you lean on me until I lie on your lap and love she lick your love lips. You are loud and loving love that lingers to lower loneliness and your love is leading me to learning love literature. I'm lucky to live the rest of my life with the most lovely ladies living. Ladies and gentlemen, that is Mr. Rhymer, the only Rhymer on planet Earth. If there is another one in Mars or any other planet, huh? we do not know about. But as far as we are known, he is the only Rhymer. And he has already charmed Vera Siddiqui. As we continue this journey to discover more about Mr. Rhymer, be stay tuned and we are going to give you more on this incredible journey with this amazing human being, Mr. And another thing I want to say, you go to my YouTube channel and see rhymes that I have there. Compare it with any other work you have seen. Mr. Raima, my YouTube channel is full of rhymes. And my TikTok, by the way, Mr. Raima too. Compare my work with any other artistic work or literary work you have ever seen. Okay. That is Mr. Raima from Wolves of Max. That's all we had for you today. Bye-bye.